So let's, let's talk about hope. Um, I know that in my journey the last couple of years, my hopes changed. You know, first I hoped that, um, you know, Ed would have 20 years, and then I hoped that he would respond to the treatment, and then I hoped that stem cell transplant would work, and then I hoped he would get out of the wheelchair, and then eventually I, I hoped he had a good death. Um, you know, I'm resilient, as, as, as I think that, that, the, the, this, uh, that run on sentence proves, but the, you know, the hope always needed to be there, and he needed you know, the, the hope the most. And I've heard it from many cancer patients that, you know, even when the news is bad, some sort of hope for something mm -hmm. is, 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 is powerful. It's enough to get you through mm -hmm. the next day. Um, can we talk a little bit about uh, the perception of, of, of hope? And, and maybe, Dale, let's start with you. In palliative care, where, where does hope play a role in our lives? Oh, I think it's critical. Uh, and as Laurie said earlier, you're alive today. And um, I, I think it varies as if, in the course of a cancer. I mean, you know, we, I think our hope is for remission, mm -hmm. maybe cure early on. And as you just eloquently said, as the disease progresses or as the recurrence is number two or number three or number four, then you hope for comfort, okay? And you, you hope for a time with your loved ones. Um, and sometimes it's very difficult. I mean, it, it's important to be realistic with people. Um, and I think that changes over the course of the illness. But realistic with hope, delivering the bad news of there is no more to do but in a hopeful way, Larry? Well, um, so I have a couple of thoughts I'd like to share briefly. I think this is a very nuanced discussion. Mm -hmm. And I, I think so. I don't know that it's as easy to say um, what is hope in the, these encounters. Uh, years ago, early on in my career as a leukemia specialist, I was developing a new drug that we had basically created the whole rationale for. And I remember late at night in the research unit, I was talking to this older lady whose husband was being treated with this drug. And they're just this couple that I fell in love with. And she grabbed my forearm and she said, this is our only hope. And I thought, oh dear God, it is not your only hope. <laughs> um, but that sense of responsibility for that, because she had so many more resources than this drug. Uh, and so what I often think of is faith, hope, and love, and the greatest of these is love. But those words were written at a time that there were no medicines. There was no sense that we controlled our biologic, our physical future. And so I, I hold on that to just remind myself and others that hope is something we bring to a situation. I don't think it's something we get from others. I may have that wrong, but I'm, that's where I am. Karen, what about hope? Again, uh, following up on what Larry had to say, just the notion of, of your own value system. You know, um, there's many faith-filled people that would say, you know, I, I hope in God and whatever he has in my mind or in my future, then th that's fine with me. And others are, are quite different and they, <coughs> and they want that hope for something definite that they will do, just as the steps you discovered with your husband. Um, so it, it just varies so much. I, again, just as Larry had indicated earlier, just being with the person, mm -hmm. helping them through that, to, to give the positive notion that they do matter from the moment they were born until the absolute very end, they still matter, and that there's hope for them to, to make sure they're able to pass on information to other, their family members. To, to do things that they think is important. So that's the essence for, and, for me. And, and one last comment that I want to make about it is being there for the patient and being with them as they, as on the journey. Mm -hmm. uh, and when the going gets tough, you have to be there mm -hmm. and, and listen. Mm 